Hey everyone, I'm Damon Smith. I'm here to give you all a tutorial on how to draw on ballpoint pen. Now while I still do use basic pencils and color pencils now and then in my artwork, I tend to prefer ballpoint a lot more these days as its darker lines and thicker shadows gives my own, benefits my personal art style a lot more. But one question I constantly get from people, both artists and not, is how do I work in it so calmly, as the permanency of ballpoint pen tends to make a lot of my friends at least very nervous when they draw with it. So I'm here to give you some basic tips on ballpoint pen. Alright, to start off what you want to do is a basic shape. So depending on what you have in mind, just think about it as most rudimentary form, the outline. So today I'm going to do Pikachu from Pokemon because it's a, it's a pretty simplistic character to draw. I don't want to keep you guys here for hours trying to draw a person or a big piece of scenery. So you get the base shape for the body and smaller shapes for the hands, feet, ears, and tail. It doesn't be perfect. This is the basic skeleton of the character. I'll add in the secondary detail accessories. So the stripes on his hand, his fingers, I believe he has a stripe on his back, and the little pattern at the base of his tail. Basics out of the way, you're going to want to go over the lines you want to keep with darker pen strokes. If you're using a scanner, I'd recommend to use the gray kind of black and white setting, as it won't pick up on the fainter lines you did for the character skeleton. Make sure to keep the lines free consistent if you can, because a pen with if you do this to color in a straight line, it'll come out kind of nasty. It'll come out really kind of sketchy looking on a scanner. Depending on what you're working on, to add actual like details to the way the skull works. So since Pikachu probably has a brow in his skull, I'm going to make this part of the frame come out a little more. Same thing here for his cheek. If you're doing a person, remember that obviously we aren't Legos. The arms and whatnot can tend to connect to the body, especially if they aren't wearing clothes where you can hide that mistake. So make sure to not go over the skeleton in parts that you don't want to show up. Now it's time for shading. Pikachu I'm going to establish a light source as being over here. You generally want to just have an idea where the light's coming from so you know how to shade in pen. So just cut, even like little things like this that won't show up at all in the scanner is good. Start with basic shapes, work on the more complex details, fill in the lines you want to fill in, and, ge and generally if you're doing scanning like I said, the lighter lines like here and here, they won't show up on the scanner. And if they do, you can, t most, even the most basic paint programs have a lighting like a contrast bar you can mess with to make that completely disappear. Alright, thank you for watching. This has been Damon Smith showing you how to draw in pen.